Hi, hello. This is Anup here, and in this video, what we are going to see is this one: File Explorer. I got upgraded my Windows 11 Insider build to the latest version that is released today, 25104.1000, and that's the version I'm using. And uh, we are going to show what is there in that particular version, especially we are going to talk about the file explorer experience, which Microsoft released in this version. Probably, I don't know whether it is for all the insiders or only for the specific insiders. OK, so let's let's go into it. As you can see over here, I have opened Windows Explorer, Windows File Explorer precise and if I if I if I double click on this it will just open that particular folder or drive etc etc right this is the normal normal experience and uh, back etc you know you know the Windows 11 file explorer experience that is what we can see over here just right click and you would be able to see open in new tab option. Right, so that is what I wanted to show in this particular video quickly. This is this is the quick video on multiple tab options in the file explorer. This is the first time I am experiencing it. It is it is pretty good experience, I would say, right? Uh, but there are some limitations. For example, I will I will show you what are those. But before that, let's let's try to check what are the things which we can over here so you can open different file explorer tabs over here and you can click on each tab and if you are expecting in microsoft edge kind of an experience like if you if you want to drag and drop a file explorer tab and open as a new Windows File Explorer that is not possible as you can see over here right that's not possible and other other way around also right if you want to add this particular tab of the file explorer to the other file explorer that is also not that is also not possible let's try to do that no that's not allowed okay so that's the cute thing about file explorer there are there are a couple of settings which you can change in the file explorer developer option there are some options for example show full path in title bar these are these are normal options i don't think there's any option particularly for multiple tabs over here in this in this and even if you if you click on if you click on the new add new tab button over here plus button over here it will open the home page basically home page of the file explorer windows file explorer microsoft deployed this home page i think i i have seen this first time a couple of builds back or i don't remember exactly but a, a month or two back i think so uh, that's uh, that's a file explorer experience, right? So let's see how how many tabs we can open. I, I don't know what is this. That button over here, button over here is helping to move the tabs. If you want to move and check each tab, you can use that. For example, you kind of do this, then then you can get that option to move to the different tabs which is kind of hidden from the ui if you reduce the size of the file explorer windows file explorer that's also a good thing and remember this is the first release experience at least for me the initial experience of windows file explorer in the Windows Insider version, as I mentioned before, it is pretty nice and it is pretty 
useful. Probably it is going to take some time to get adjust uh, with the file explorer option. We cannot use the tab, alt tab kind of option similar to um, Microsoft Edge to move between the tabs. That's not there. Okay, so um, as I mentioned, this is the early versions version of. Windows File Explorer. So all these things might be coming soon. Are uh, probably in production for the I don't know 23 H2 version of Windows 11. Until then, if you want to play around with these new File Explorer option, I think you need to get into a, a Windows Insider build and. Uh, experience that so that's the uh, experience of a uh, file explorer multiple tab file explorer experience right file explorer tabs option it also gives an option to drag and drop files between different tabs for example if you want to copy this particular file to another tab you can you can do that like this Right, so that option is also there. That's pretty nice, right? So we don't need to open different windows in this to copy the files between the file explorer. As I showed, just you can drag and drop, drag and drop, drag and drop. <laughs> So that's that's the good option, I think. Let's try this one. Okay. See that drag and drop worked for two of the files, as you can see. And that's also an interesting option with a Windows File Explorer tabs. I hope this video was useful. Thank you all for watching. See you next time. Bye bye.